Well, a 67-12 win over Richmond. What a great way to start the BNI Cup this afternoon. Yeah, definitely. Like, um, I haven't played in a while. I've played the first game, took my hammy, so it's good to get some game time. All of us are blowing, but we went out there to play. Hopefully, everyone enjoyed it. But we played some good stuff. A uh, couple of things to tweak for next, next, uh, the next game. But you know, we're happy with that, obviously. Yeah, uh, man of the match performance from yourself. You must have been really pleased with your display. It was uh, some great ball carrying and a couple of tries as well. Yeah, it's happy days. I mean, to be fair, the boys got the ball to me in a bit of space yeah. quite a few times, so you know, I got to thank the boys for doing that. But um, I always like to get my hands on the ball in a bit of space, and then uh, on this pitch, open running, it's happy yeah. days. Yeah, showed some outstanding pace for that try in the second half. A great move from the backs, and then you were uh, you were put away from about 35 metres. That must uh, must have pleased you a lot. Yeah, definitely. Like I said, like the boys did all the work in the middle, yeah. like fixed the one. When they put me away, I've just got to finish it, so no, I'm obviously happy with that. Yeah, I think it's 11 tries this afternoon. That's a hell of a statement to make, a real team effort as well. Yeah, definitely. Like I said, quite a few boys have not that much game time for the first couple of games of the season, so everyone put a hand up for selection. We've got Connor next week and then back into the league then, so happy days. Yeah, it just shows the depth in this squad and the quality as well. We made 12 changes, but you've already mentioned it. People kind of chomping at the bit to get some game time, and that was definitely on display this afternoon. Yeah, I think that's huge this season. We've got a real strong squad. Like Everyone's fighting for, for, for position. So, um, again, competitive squad, then hopefully we can put those performances in them. Devon's fighting for a place. Um, real, real statement today. Obviously, we made the semi finals last year of the BNI Cup, um, and today put us on, the, put us on track for a, for a great start and maybe go one further this year. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, our aim last year was to try and get to the final. Yeah. We, got, we missed out by one, so hopefully, this year, get to the final and then, you know. Finals rugby, anything can happen, but um, I think we just take one game, game at a time. Connor yeah. won't be easy next yeah. weekend. Um, play there before, and it's you know it's a tough place to play. Yeah. So we've just got to cut the mistakes out that we gave did today, even though we went well. And then hopefully next week we uh, play well. Yeah, you've already mentioned it. I've obviously scored a quite a few tries today, but Galway will be a, a very tough place to go and play. It'll be, I'd imagine it'll be a very different game to the one this afternoon. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, this is 4G yeah. away there, and I think there's a storm coming in as well. So yeah. I think we we'll have to change how we play a little bit, but um, you know different game but we play well like we did today and yeah. you know hopefully we can get a win yeah uh, start with a bonus point today so uh, next weekend's a chance to, to really take control of the pool as well yeah exactly we spoke about it then you know if we can get a win next weekend we'll be in a really strong position there well played today cheers mate uh, Cod is a 67-12 win over Richmond as a start to a competition I'd say that's uh, that's pretty perfect isn't it uh, I wouldn't say perfect but certainly positive I think um, look we uh, we look really dangerous ball in hand yeah. just switched off a couple of times but as you say, a really positive start, five points to start the competition and we move on to next week. Yeah, uh, scored 11 tries. What was the most pleasing thing for you about uh, about this afternoon? Um, well, I, I thought the ambition at times. Uh, scored some really good tries, but uh, disappointed to concede a couple, if I'm honest. Um, and obviously five points to start with and now we move on to Connacht. Um, a huge test, as you'll know from your time over there. It's, uh, it's a very difficult place to go and win. No, it is. It's, I think for me it's a, it's a huge game. Uh, very, different, very different conditions we experienced today, so that's, that's going to be a big challenge for the players. But uh, Look, we're, we're in a good place, we've had a really good league campaign, yeah. we've parked that and started the BNI in really good fashion, so uh, positive but still plenty to work on. Yeah, it uh, was one of the most pleasing things as well, the fact that we made a lot of changes but those players were obviously looking to prove a point and they certainly did that today. No, absolutely, we've said all week that uh, it's our effort this year will be a squad effort, yeah. not, a, not a team effort and we knew um, that we'd give the boys opportunities that potentially haven't played for a couple of weeks and uh, I thought the majority of those put their hands up and we'll have another crack yeah. next week. Yeah, some great performances out there. I guess that's given you a few selection headaches. The likes of uh, Will Harris, who picked man of the match, was uh, outstanding today. Yeah, no, he was one of many, but certainly deserved the man of the match and both in attack and defence was, was really pleasing. So, uh, as you say, let's, let's build for next week and uh, we'll have a go again in Galway. Yeah, obviously a positive start to the championship as well and I guess it pleases you the fact that we've carried on that momentum into a different competition as well. Yeah, no, listen, this is... Uh, it's a really important competition for us, as it was last year. Uh, we went very well last year, and, and the challenge for us again is to is to, to do the same this year. And first and foremost, we've just got to focus on the pool stages, and obviously next week being uh, really important. In that. Um, and it's a, obviously with a with a good win today, it's a chance for us to take control of the pool next week in Connacht. A, uh, a tough place to go, but we'll go there with uh, with a lot of confidence now. Yeah, no, the boys are confident, but we understand, as you say, it's, it's a tough place to go, and uh, we won't have seen obviously much of how they play. So uh, we'll go there and focus on ourselves and uh, hopefully push on next you week. You made your debut for Ealing 12 finals this afternoon. How did you enjoy it out there? Yeah, it was good to get out and finally get a run. Um, it's my first game of the year, so lungs were blowing a bit, but it was good to get out and uh, we got a good scoreline as well, so I'm pretty happy. Yeah, you look like you were enjoying yourself out there. Not Some nice kicks in behind and also from the tee as well. You were 100%, I think. Uh, yeah, well, the lads up front made a, they made a good platform for me, so it was, it was quite easy to, to pick my spot or whatever, and the boys outside are feeding in the information as well, so it was a good team effort. Uh, 
like I said, we're happy with the win and we're happy to put up a big scoreline and moving on to next week now. Yeah, you came on when we were fairly far in front. Um, is that challenging to kind of keep the keep the tempo going all the time as a ten? Uh, it can be sometimes, but I think when you're making your debut, you're kind of you're humming on the sideline anyway. You're, you want to get on as soon as you can. So uh, I was just delighted to get on and get a run, get the first one under the belt, and hopefully I can build on that now moving forward. Yeah, um, look back at the game, 67-12. I think 11 tries, um, a really good uh, all-round team performance today. Uh, yeah, so it, it obviously starts up front, so big ups to the forwards, they really fronted up yeah. and then I think uh, they gave us a good platform and we uh, we put some good width in the ball at times. I think our wingers got a couple of tries each, which is which uh, shows that it was exciting to watch. And um, yeah, I think uh, we played pretty well as a group, but I think we can still build and uh, moving on to next week now, hopefully we'll build on this. Yeah, and as a start to the BNI Cup with the bonus point win, we couldn't have really asked for more than that, I guess. No, well, that's, that's the aim. You come out, you, you look to win a game and then... Uh, once you get a, if you once you go ahead, like it's nice to get that uh, that fourth try and then keep uh, the scoreboard taken and get the first five points. Yep. And now off to Connacht next week. Uh, obviously, you spent a, a few years there, so you'll be looking forward to going back, I guess. Uh, yeah. So it'd be a bit of a weird one going back, uh, playing against all my best mates and stuff. Yeah. So. Uh, but yeah, look, it's another challenge in itself. I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully, like I said, we can build on today, go over there, and hopefully uh, get a result as well. Yeah, you'll know it after having lots of visiting teams. It's a very tough place to go and win, so we'll have to raise our performance next weekend. Yeah, the weather can be uh, a bit all over the place. It can be raining sideways and stuff, so uh, it could be a hurricane or anything. But yeah, so I look forward to getting back there and getting another run out there again. Yep, and after the win today, obviously a win next weekend will put us in a very nice position when we head back into the championship. So that'll be our aim next weekend, I guess. Yeah, so we've made, obviously made a good start to the championship. Uh, our aim from the first two games here is two wins, so we're halfway there now. So hopefully we can uh, pull it together again next week, play well and get a second win. Well done, sir. Cheers. Thanks, man.